Well, now to pressure at the pump. Gas prices are starting to climb. They usually drop after Labor Day, but that's not the case this summer. Action News reporter Caroline Goggin takes a look at what drivers are paying in our region. With a gallon of gas nearing $4 in the greater Philadelphia area, John Spear crosses state lines to save a few bucks. I come down here for my gas and my wife's cigarettes. When Barbara Corte pulls up to the pump, she watches the price continue to rise. More than $74 to fill her tank. When we take like trips, road trips, it is very expensive. According to AAA, the national average stands at $3.88. That's the highest it's been this year, up 21 cents from this time last year. In the Philadelphia metro area, the average is $3.96 a gallon. In South Jersey, it's $3.70. And in northern Delaware, it's $3.68. The reason for the increase? Crude oil. That being because a gallon of gasoline is made up of about 50 to 60 percent crude oil. When crude oil prices fluctuate, as will gas prices. But in our area, AAA says prices have been relatively stable and relief could be coming. This past weekend, we made that switch over to winter blended gasoline, which is less expensive to refine and produce so that savings is passed along to consumers. AAA says something that could factor into another rise in prices is hurricane season. For anything that disrupts the refining capabilities, distribution, all of that in the U.S. Gulf Coast would result in a temporary increase in gas prices. AAA tells us if you want to stretch your tank of gas, keep up on routine maintenance, clear all of the stuff out of your trunk and make sure to consolidate your trips. In Roxborough, I'm Caroline Goggin, Channel 6 Action News.